everybody. So today I thought it would be a great idea to talk about my opinions on the Trackner horse. I'm not really sure if that's how you pronounce it. I've been told before that's how you pronounce it. Other people say it's not how you pronounce it, but anyway, I still bought the horse because I really like it. So I like the Trackner horse, so I thought I would talk about why I do or maybe sometimes don't. But for the most part, I do like the horse. I have the... Wow, somebody is just speeding outside, apparently. Anyway, yeah, I don't really have a lot of them, but I do have a few, and I do like them. But the Trackner horse has been edited before, so let's talk about that. So when the Trackner horse first was released, now there never was a Gen 1 or Gen 2 option, it was always Gen 3. And with Gen 3, when it first came out, I loved this horse. Like, I really did love it a lot. I loved the gates on it, and I really liked the animations. However... Although I thought the horse is amazing, a lot of people apparently didn't think so. And then were like, hey, Star Stable, you know, change the horse, and they did. And now the gates are all messed up. The horse is broken pretty much at my, you know, at this point. Like, the trot was so good before, and now it's basically a starter horse. Like, since the horse got updated again, like, it looks like a starter horse. And it's so annoying because, like, I feel like we had a pretty good looking horse, and now we don't. So... I do like the horse a lot, but now that I just remembered that it got changed, I'm like, never mind, because there was a few times where I wanted to buy more of them, but then I just didn't because obviously it got changed for no reason. Like, the trot was so fine, and people were like, yeah, let's just complain about it, and now we have a broken horse, so thanks guys, that, that was great. You know, I do think that some horses should be changed. There are a lot of horses in the game that I feel like should be edited a little bit. But, like, people complain about the wrong horse, I feel like, sometimes. And then we get accidents, like the Trackner horse. Which, the Trackner horse always looked similar to the starter model. I feel like because the Trackner is a warm blood, and also because the Jorvik warm blood is a warm blood, I mean, like, they're both gonna look similar. But they look awfully similar. Like, a little bit too similar. So now we have, basically, a second starter horse now. So, we have a Trackner horse, and it is, it's a good looking horse, but I would like to comment that because of the inconsistencies in the art style in Star Stable's horses, the Trackner horse has those very, like, cartoony eyes, meanwhile all the other horses, or mostly all the other horses, are pretty realistic. It's just kind of odd that we have horses that are, like, cartoony, and then we have realistic horses, which, like, I'm okay with cartoony horses, however... They're from the same generation, so it's kind of odd. It's like sometimes I feel like Star Stable doesn't know whether to have cartoony horses or realistic horses, or both. In my opinion though, after like really thinking about it, I feel like Star Stable should have stuck with the like cartoony aesthetic because the Fjord and the Akiltik, the Trackner, the Jorvik Starter Horse, even the Jorvik Pony, they have like really cartoony eyes. And, like, I feel like if Star Stable kept that up, maybe players would have been a little bit happier, maybe. Because it feels like Star Stable to have that little bit of life in the horse. Because a lot of horses, the realistic ones at least, they are so realistic, you know? But I think in the game, when they have that, like, cartoony looking, like, eye to them they just look a little bit more lively and alive and less soulless because a lot of the horses in this game feel soulless because there's no, like, realism. You know, because when I'm recording this, you know, we don't really have that. So, I feel like the Trackner kind of flopped. I mean, at first it didn't. I liked it a lot, but a lot of people protested for better, and then we got worse. So it's kind of our fault, but then, like, it also just is what it is. I don't know. I never complained about it until they changed it, so. So yeah, this was a very messy video. I apologize for background noise. I literally can't control if people are loud or not, so whatever. But yeah, that's it. Bye.